I think that Christianity is epistemically justified, not just pragmatically, epistemically justified, even in the absence of argument and evidence, on the basis of the witness of the Holy Spirit, which makes belief in the gospel a pr uh, properly basic belief uh, rooted in the witness of the Spirit. And so in the absence of some defeater of that, I think you are epistemically justified uh, in believing in Christ, even if you don't have arguments and evidence in support of it. So I'm, I'm act this may surprise you. I, I am actually an evidentialist, but I'm also a Reformed epistemologist. So oh. I think that, yeah, so Reformed epistemology, as far as oh. my understanding, is that you don't need arguments in order to justify right. belief in Christianity. But I think there's a guy, as a, he's a friend of mine, personal friend of mine, he's also a philosopher, his name is Tyler McNabb, and he does a lot of great work on yeah. Reformed epistemology. He's an evidentialist as well. What he says is that you've still got to have evidence for your beliefs, and that, and what he does is he basically just broadens his view of evidence. So evidence yes, can include exactly. philosophical seemings and, you know, th these yes. sorts of things. And so that's where I come from. I, I'm I'm in agreement with you that we don't need arguments, but I, I do nevertheless think that we do need evidence. Yes. Well, now you show yourself to be right on the cutting edge of contemporary discussions, Cameron. I, I'm very impressed. In my systematic philosophical theology, I have a discussion of Reformed epistemology in which I take account of this new wrinkle that broadens the conception of evidence beyond what Plantinga meant by evidence. He meant argument and inference. Yeah. But now, so-called phenomenal conservatives are willing to take the way something seems to you to be evidence. So if it seems to you that there is an external world, um, then that's evidence that there is an external world and you are justified in believing the external world, even in the absence of some sort of an argument on the basis of the way things seem to you, so long as you do not have a defeater of that seeming. So actually, I, I'm very sympathetic with your view as well. <laughs>